Well, you must have seen different bloggers talking about Rema and uh, Dr. Hamza on social media, but you don't understand what is going on. But hey, sit back, relax, because I have the lady that is being talked about clarifying on what's circulating in the media. Because man, the, the videos I posted, Zira Kira Talanti, you were even kissing my neck. And also, there's a lot of fear in Bobby Wine's camp. I'm going to tell you what is going on right there. And doctors want government to consider a lockdown in Kampala as soon as possible. Otherwise, we're all going to die because Ebola is hitting so hard in different parts of Kampala. Now, this is the only platform where you'll get the biggest trending stories in the current affairs and also in the entertainment industry with a lot of professionalism applied. So I'm asking you to be part of the Buzz UG by subscribing and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melad Milo, aka Fula. <laughs> Now, the Uganda Medical Association president, that is Dr. Samuel Oledo, has recommended that stringent measures, including a lockdown, be considered for Kampala. This comes when Ebola cases in Greater Kampala have risen to 15 in the last 48 hours. Now, Dr. Oledo cautions that Ebola is not a political disease, urging Ugandans to take extra vigilance, explaining that 5 out of 10 people who get Ebola die. Kampala should have a restriction of movement. Let us hold Kampala when it is still early. The earlier we lock down Kampala, the better. Ugandans are still taking it as something so minor. It is catastrophic that right now, people are not reporting cases. Now, yesterday, NBS TV ran an investigative report showing how Ugandans are robbed of their hard-earned money by a gang headed by a gentleman known as Tata Sula. Now, Ugandans on different social media platforms appreciated NBS journalists on that investigative report, that is Kanari Mugume and other colleagues. Now, finally, police has arrested this gang leader, Tata Sula, and uh, this has been confirmed by Luke Oweisijire, Kampala Metropolitan Police Deputy Spokesperson. NBS, we are here to be able to do this. Of course, we are going to be able to do this. We are to be able to do this. We are going to be able to do this. We are going to be able to do this. Now, before I take you to Rema Namakula's story, I told you that there is a lot of fear in His Excellency Bobby Wine's camp. Now, following the death of Jakana Naduli, Motive Kasaga, Bobby Wine's supporter, has revealed that he could be the next to die because while he was being tortured in CMY, he was injected with dangerous drugs that up to now he's still suspicious about. Now, he says when he tried to ask about those injections, they told him they were meant to make him recover. He now fears that he could die very soon, claiming that he has not even been feeling well since he returned home. Now, speaking about the entertainment industry, Ugandans are wondering what's going on in the entertainment industry. Just recently, Gravity Omotuju cried at a press conference and he made headlines in the media. And yesterday, Chris Evans was hosted on Anatalia's show, Big Endabitia, on Sanyuka TV, and he was also seen crying. And guess what? The reason for his crying is quite the same with that of Gravity Omotuju. Mm. Just 
So Ugandans on different platforms are wondering what's going on in the entertainment industry. Something is not right. I don't know what you guys think, but Chris Evans has a concert coming up this Saturday. Let's go and support him. Now, the lady who has been seen in pictures and videos on social media with Dr. Hamza, Rema Namakula's husband, has apologized to Rema Namakula, Dr. Hamza, and everyone who has been hurt by this news circulating in the media. She says she didn't know this would turn out to be like it is right now in the media. Otherwise, for her, she just recorded and posted for fun with no bad intentions. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't know how I can reach out, doctor. And I apologize to him because really the, f the videos I posted Zira Kina Talanti Kina Talanti You were even kissing my neck I was seeing that we were together you holding my hand I can video come elevator twice while you kissing a blue on my neck I can't get a dollar we are lovers. But so many more have a daily. Now we manage the social media. People are just bad. But I'm also worried about my reputation, my family. Like I didn't know it would it would be like that. I'm going to do just so. I have seen you can never flow anymore. Meanwhile, Kapere, the comedian, says he's ready to love Rema Namakula wholeheartedly because it seems Rema is very unlucky in relationships and therefore Kapere says he has enough experience in matters love, so Rema shouldn't be looking any further. <laughs> But do it up, Bamba Rob Suti, Atena Gambala, Rima, Jangu, Nina Spears, Mulav, Jangu, Ragalavu, Elana Matala, Abo Tebaina Lavu, Aba Sajabo Nababidi, Oba Zari, Nayel de Cafe, Nova Tonzari, Soke, in such a name, Maniko, Rashi Gayange, Novurunji Wange, Nip Sazange. We do not want to go to the house. We do not Oh my God. Well, there you go. That is the latest information I have for you right now on The Buzz UG. And in case you have anything on your mind, you want to comment on these stories, just put it down in the comment section. But most importantly, subscribe to The Buzz UG in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melads Milo, a.k.a. Fuller. It's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio jungle.